Hey there, YouTubers and RuneScapers, it's me, Louis Slash Alox, and I just want to give advice really quickly before I start the video about the Royal Dehyde. If you guys ever plan on going outside and you've been stuck indoors all the time playing RuneScape this, like, spring and su early summer, I would suggest bringing sunscreen, suntan lotion, or sunscreen, whatever you call that thing that protects you, because I got sunburned just from being outside for, like, three, four hours at a flea market with Victoria and her parents at... The Meadowlands, which is a place in my state that people, there's a flea market every Saturday, and I got burned, just from being outside for like 3-4 hours. So I started questioning, have I really been on RuneScape that long that the, I'm not immune to the sun? <laughs> but um, anyways, Royal Dehyde armor, guys. Royal Dehyde. This armor, it came out with the Queen Black Dragon update. And the armor is very, very, like, powerful. It is really good. It's better than Black Dehyde. It's better than Full Carols, Carols, however you pronounce it. And it's basically the same as Armadil. It is just about the same as, as it. Like, it, the, the stat difference is, like, a couple of numbers off. Like, not even a lot. It's not even more than ten numbers off of it. It's, like, basically the same. And it costs over 20 mil cheaper. Over 20 mil less, I don't know how to word that. But yeah, so Armadil, full Armadil is like 25, 27 mil, something like that. And this armor is like not even 200k as of like right now in this video. And it's basically the same. And it also like the armor looks better than, I mean, I personally think it looks better than Armadil. I mean, if you see the, um, if you see how like it looks on people, like the armor actually changes. Like if you're a girl character and you wear it, it's actually like a skirt. Instead of being like a full chaps, like um, in a guy character. I don't know if you've seen it, but it looks really good. It looks better than Armadil. It really does. And not to mention, I kind of think that the armor looks like a rip-off Torva. I mean, that's just me. It looks like a rip-off version of Torva. It really does. But, um, yeah, so it's just very, like, ugh. But it's really powerful, guys. I mean, it is really powerful. It's it's better than Black Dehyde, better than Carol's, and it's literally the same as Armadil. And I don't, I don't think that... It should be this cheap. I think Royal Dehyde should be more expensive because it compares to Armadil, and Armadil is 20-something mil. Also, the um, if you just compare the top and the bottom with the Royal Dehyde top and bottom, the Royal Dehyde has more magic absorb than Armadil. It's like 12% versus 10%. I believe that's how much it is when I checked online. And, I mean, correct me if I'm wrong with that exact amount. Please correct me down below. But, um, yeah, so it compares to it. And I think that Royal Dehyde really should be more money. It really should. And, like, if anything, maybe Jagex should, like, not have Royal Dehyde dropped by the, um... Like, I don't know, like, maybe nerf it a little bit. Like, not have the Grotworms drop Royal Dehyde and, like, have only Royal Dehyde from the Queen Black Dragon. Possibly, like, I mean, that's sort of an idea that I have because Royal Dehyde is really powerful. I mean, like... Look at full Ganodermic, for instance. Like, Gano is, like, 4 mil for the full set about, and it's really good. What? Yeah, I know that. Sorry, my little brother was talking to me. Anyways, yeah, so, like, I think they should, like, not have Grotworms drop the Royal Dehyde, and I think only the QBD should have Royal Dehyde, like, offered to you, because, I mean, like, the QBD also is really powerful, and the methods to kill it, I mean, you really can't be, like, a noob to kill it. Like, you have to actually try. That boss is really difficult. I mean, I consider it one of the most difficult bosses. It is. Um, I mean, yeah, because, like, next, you, you can literally AFK next. You can AFK Queen Black Dragon. Like, I, I know friends that are like, oh, yeah, we AFK next all the time because, like, it rarely hits us. Like, I have friends that do that. But, like, QBD is really yeah. strong yeah. and really powerful. So, I mean, it's, I mean, sure, people are, like, doing QBD easier now. They're like, oh, yeah, we can kill, like, five an hour, or, like, five, ten an hour now. Like, but it's five still, like, trip. you have to have the stats and the gear. And you have to know how to, like, actually do it well in order to actually yeah. camp it. And, like, do extremely good with QBD. Like, you have to learn how to, like, camp it. And you have to have the right gear. Like, it is very difficult to welfare it. Except if you're doing range, then, like, you could use Royal Dehyde and, like, well, like, camp it the entire hour. Kill, like, maybe three, four an hour with using just strictly range. But, yeah, basically, Royal Dehyde is very powerful. And I think it should be worth more. I don't know what you guys think. Leave your uh, comments below. That's what I think. You guys let me know. And bye-bye, guys, and take care, and la-la-la-la-la, subscribe, like, all that jazz. Okay, where's the stop button?